okay so in this video we'll be trying to solve you no know, some integrals you know, these integrals involves the power formula you know, for this one we have our first integral here uh, sine y dy you know, the integral of sine y dy is uh, over cosine squared y you know? so for our solution first okay we need to find our u you know? for this one our u is cosine y then our du will be so the derivative of cosine y is negative sine y dy you know? then we could uh, rewrite this you no know, given um, integral you know, into um, we will just put you no know, our cosine squared y or our denominator you no know, to the to the to the numerator using the property of exponent so we will have cosine y raised to the power of negative 2 no then sine y dy so for this instance it is now obvious that our n our n is equal to negative 2 no so Going back to the formula, no, for the power formula. So we have here the integral of u to the n du is equal to u to the n plus 1 over n plus 1. So let's check if for the given integral, we have our u and n and our du. No, for our u, so we have cosine y. For our n, we have negative 2. For our du, so we have sine y, negative sine y dy. No, for this instance, uh, we don't have any negative. No? So, with that, we just add a negative sign no? before the integral or um, to, to be specific, we'll put here negative 1. No? But we just uh, um, have that uh, negative 1 omitted for simplicity. So, then we have here negative sine y dy okay so we have here our du and of course because we put a negative sign on the on the outside part of our integral so we could still retain the same integral no okay so you using now the formula so we have u to the n so that will be cosine y so n plus one so negative two plus one then over n plus one so we have negative 2 plus 1 okay then this will be equal to uh, cosine y raised to the power of negative 1 because negative 2 plus 1 is negative 1 over negative 1 also but remember we have still a negative 1 here no from this 1 so this this will be negative 1 okay so we'll end up with so this is negative one negative one that will be positive so we end up with cosine y raised to the power of negative one plus c or simplifying this one further so we could have uh, one over cosine y plus c no? using identity so we could say that the reciprocal of cosine is second no so so, or the reciprocal of second is um, cosine, no? the other way around. So we have to write this one as second y plus c. And this is now our answer.